So we will work with some calculations with degrees, minutes, and seconds. We will see degrees, minutes, and seconds throughout the course, so it's important that we know how to add and subtract when degrees, minutes, and seconds are involved. Here we have two angles that we're adding together, 28 degrees, 35 minutes, plus 63 degrees, and 52 minutes. Let's write it vertically, 28 degrees, 35 minutes, lining up the degrees and the minutes. And we're asked to add these together. So how many minutes, we're going to add within the categories, how many minutes do we have? It looks like we have 87 minutes. And how many degrees do we have? It looks like we have 91 degrees. Now, 87 minutes. We know that every 60 minutes represent one whole degree. So let's borrow from here. Let's borrow 60 minutes and convert that to one degree. So we can actually write this a little bit simpler and call this 92 degrees. And when we sit, subtract those 60 minutes and bring them over and represent it as one degree, now we have 27 minutes. Okay, let's do 180 degrees now minus 117 degrees and 29 minutes. So let's line everything up, 180 degrees minus 117 degrees and 29 minutes. It looks like here that we don't have any minutes to subtract from. So let's borrow a minute, or sorry, let's borrow um, from a degree. So let's write this as 179 degrees. And we're going to borrow a degree and we're going to write it as 60 seconds. We know that 60 seconds would make up one degree, but we're going to borrow one degree and we're going to rewrite it as 60 seconds. That way we can do the subtraction. 60 minutes minus 29 minutes, well that would be 39, 31 minutes, and then 179 minus 117, that would be 62 degrees. 73 degrees, 23 minutes, minus 47 degrees, and 48 minutes. Let's line up our degrees and our minutes, one on top of the other. And we want to subtract, we have 23 minus 48. What we want to do, since 23 is smaller than 48, is to borrow one degree from 73. So I'll write this as 72 degrees, and that degree that we borrowed, we know that represents the same thing as 60 minutes. So we're going to add 60 minutes to our minutes column. And that total combined together gives me a total of 83 minutes. Now 83 minutes minus 48 gives us 35 minutes. And 72 minus 47 would be 25 degrees. So 25 degrees in 35 minutes.